how we feed ourselves is vital, right? Yes, we want to know what's going on if we look at the front page of the newspaper, if we look at our news feed, if we watch what's going on on television. Okay, we have to have a certain level of information to be smart, but we don't have to live in that negative news that we're going through each and every day. It means think about the people who've made huge impacts against the most incredible odds or read about them. Easy to research this day, and I'm a big believer is go back to the basics of reading books. Reading books slows down our thinking. Coupled with a journal, I always think it's really important to have one book to read and one book to write in. If I can read great stories, as I've been rereading, and many of you know who spend time with me, the story of Mandela. If I can go back and look at Martin Luther King's journey, or what Gandhi had accomplished, or Alexander the Great, right? Often it's spoken about Steve Jobs or Jeff Bezos at Amazon. There are great people who've pushed, about, pushed past insurmountable odds. I want to understand what they were thinking about and how they were thinking about it and how they went about it and how they fed their mind and guarded their mind from the conversations that may be going on too frequently, which generate a level of fear.